Julie has been uh, in the community for a long time, living just down the road. And um, she has not only served at Wakaiva, but also coached lacrosse. She wants to make uh, everyone's experience um, in her current placement, wherever she is, whether that's teaching or coaching, the best it can possibly be. And that's really the heart of, of Julie Gabovic. I think of Julie as an expert in the science of teaching and learning. She knows her kids. She's got K through five in this building. <clears throat> she can tell you their names. She can tell you their interests. She can tell you their strengths and weaknesses. And quite frankly, any kid who walks into her class knows that they're going to be well respected and it's a safe environment. And quite frankly, they all think they're her favorite student. I did a little survey. I asked a second grader, what can you tell me about Miss Gab? She says she tells us stuff we don't know and helps us to live science. Julie's the best. I would choose dedicated. Um, she is absolutely dedicated in so many ways. She, she's not only dedicated in, in making people feel welcome at Wakaiva, but she's dedicated in making sure every student shows growth in some way, no matter where they come from academically. Her dedication is not just education, but really her, her her dedication to Wakaiva and, and how, how much this place means to her um, and it shows in her day-to-day -day work. I settled on instrumental. She's instrumental in helping to create and continue this positive and, and energetic environment we have at our school. She helps new staff members become acclimated to new policies and procedures through a mentorship program that she's actually implemented herself. She creates all kinds of opportunities for not just students, but for staff members to show their leadership skills. And quite frankly, she makes the rest of us glad we came to work today. That it's a great way to share how awesome this job is with like a bigger audience. Because I think it's a bad time right now for, for education. I'm in a, a new teacher mentor group here and part of our information is like around 50% of all new teachers in the first five years are done. They quit. Teachers don't get into this job for the money, obviously, <laughs> but you have to stay motivated somehow over lots of years. And I think admin is stretched super thin at every school. And there are so many people, teachers that have strengths that could fill a lot of those gaps or pick up the pieces and it keeps teachers motivated.